Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove your phone number from FaceTime. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, say you got a new phone number and your FaceTime is still associated with your old phone number and you want to remove that phone number, it's easy to remove that old phone number and I'll also show you how to add a new phone number. Now, let's head into our settings here and we'll scroll down until we find FaceTime. Right under messages is FaceTime here. And you can see FaceTime is toggled on and it says you can be reached by FaceTime at, and it has a phone number and an email address. Now, if you want to remove that phone number associated with FaceTime, you can just tap on your email address here and untap where it says your phone number. It says remove number from iMessage and FaceTime. This number will no longer be used for iMessage and FaceTime on all your devices. You can still use it for phone calls and SMS. So just hit that remove button and you'll remove that old phone number from FaceTime. Now say you have a new phone number and you want to associate that with FaceTime. We can go back out of here and scroll all the way up until you see your name and iCloud. Tap on your name, and then you can see the very first option is name, phone numbers, and email. So we'll tap on that, and again, it will say reachable at, and it has an email address and a phone number. We can tap the edit button right next to reachable at, and then hit add email or phone number and then add phone number. Now this will pop up with an option that you can add a phone number. If you just got a new phone number, you can add that phone number to your iCloud account. And it says a verification code will be sent to this number. So you have to verify that you actually own this new number. But once you go through those steps, then you'll be able to go back into FaceTime and associate your FaceTime with this new phone number. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.